everyone. This is Healthy Harold and I'm Jade. Welcome to Healthy Harold's Check-In. Harold wants to know, how are you feeling today? Harold, how are you feeling today? Harold's feeling surprised because we've received so many letters from you guys already. We hope to keep receiving more. Today we have a letter from Max in Ranella and he says, Dear Harold, Lately I have been hearing a lot about the coronavirus and I'm feeling confused. It is making me have to wash my hands a lot and stay home more. Mum says it's like a germ. What are germs? What is coronavirus? From Max. Hi Max, thanks for your question. It is okay to feel confused and we all feel that way from time to time. But let me explain to you what germs are to help you feel less confused. Germs are found all over the world, in all kinds of places. Germs are tiny organisms or living things that can make our bodies sick. Germs are so tiny that you need to use a microscope to be able to see them. Germs can enter the body through the mouth, through the nose, the eyes, and even cuts on our skin. To help prevent that from happening, we can do something very simple. We can wash our hands with soap and water. To help you feel less confused about the coronavirus, which is a type of germ, let's read a story from Manuela Molina at mindhearts.kids. Hello, I'm a virus, cousins with the flu and a common cold. My name is coronavirus. I love to travel and to jump from hand to hand to say hi, high five. <laughs> Have you heard about me? Yes? No? How do you feel when you hear my name? Relaxed? Confused? Worried? Curious? Nervous? Or sad? I can understand you feel maybe a bit nervous or confused. I would feel the same. Maybe you can draw a picture on how you feel about the coronavirus. And sometimes adults get worried when they read the news or see me on TV. <laughs> That's me. He thinks he's a superstar. But I am going to explain myself so you can understand. When I come to visit, I bring difficulty breathing, fever, and cough. <coughs> but I don't stay with people for long and almost everyone gets better. Just like when you get a scrape on your knee and it heals, bye-bye. So don't you worry, the adults who take care of you will help keep you safe. What adults help keep you safe? Is it mum, dad, maybe it's an auntie or uncle or another carer. And you can help by doing a few things too. One, by washing your hands with soap and water while singing a song, oh, good job, Harold. You can sing your favorite song, the happy birthday song or the alphabet song. Two, by using hand sanitizer and by letting it dry on your hands. Without moving them, count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Once your hands are dry, you can get back to playing if you do all that, I will not come to visit. While the doctors work to find a vaccine that will allow me to say hi without getting you sick. The end. Now I hope that helps you understand a bit more about the coronavirus. Before we go today, Harold and I want to show you a little experiment that you can try at home that shows the importance of washing hands with soap and water to keep germs away like the coronavirus. To try this experiment at home, you will need pepper, a bowl of water, and some soap or dishwashing detergent, also in a bowl. Today, the pepper is going to be the germs like the coronavirus. Okay, you're going to put that into the water. Crack lots of pepper in, lots and lots. Okay. The water is representing our hands, okay? And the soap 
is representing when we wash our hands with soap. So we sprinkled some germs or pepper into the water and we're going to stick one finger in to see what happens. What happened? I have germs or pepper in this instance. So now what we're going to do is we're going to use our other hand and we're going to dip it in the liquid soap. Okay, we'll put a bit on because to make sure that we can see it. And then we're going to dip that finger into our pepper or our germs to see what happens. Are we ready? <gasps> wow! What happened? When I put my finger with the soap in the bowl, all of the germs ran away. Okay? And this is why it's so important that we wash our hands with soap and water to help keep all of the germs like the coronavirus away. Pretty cool, huh? Thanks for your great question, Max. I hope that clears things up for you a bit. If you have a question that you would like to ask Healthy Harold and I, please send it to healthyharold.sa at lifeeducation.org.au. Healthy Harold and I also love receiving your drawings and pictures or things that you have been up to. So please feel free to send them in too. Thanks for being part of Healthy Harold Check-In. Stay safe and make healthy choices. We look forward to seeing you soon. Bye. The time has come to say goodbye. We really have to go. We hope you had some fun today. We sure did we know. Stay healthy and safe and be a good friend from the start.